What is up guys and welcome back to my Final Fantasy 7 remake walkthrough. I'm your Mike of Zero Achievement. And today we're gonna continue on with chapter 7 and the I mean chapter 8 and the side missions here. So without further ado, let's continue on and I believe the next side mission will be back here at the hideout if i'm not mistaken so let's have a quick look now that things and are starting to settle down a bit we can finally play whack-a-box again it's all thanks to you oh yeah i forgot there's this tired looking guy out by the community center and i heard he was looking for some help okay interesting moggy's kind of interesting huh he's weird but he makes everyone around him really happy You'll see. Uh, I hope he does. So anyway, let's look at the quests first. And that's the next one we have to do. Okay, that's the next one we're going to do. And then we're going to do these two. Let's hope these don't take too long. And then we can do these next in this video. I want to become strong just like you. Oh, hey, Cloud. You're just in time for our favorite game, Whack-A-Box. You want in? It's super fun. The rules are easy. The person who whacks the most boxes is crowned champion of the hideout. What do you think? We usually don't let adults play, but since you're cool, we're gonna make a special exception just for you. Okay, why not? Okay, the basic rule is destroy as many boxes as possible within the time limit. Each box will add to your score. Okay. Ooh, that's gonna be easy, it looks like. Let's you maybe we should use the operator mode. Target score. Come on, destroy it, would you? Can can I use this? Yes we can. And damn, destroyed it good. Come on, hurry. This won't take long. No, it will not. Yeah, I know how to get through here. Full here kill. Nah, of course not that way. Ability. Yeah, that was easy. <laughs> okay, we're gonna get you at least 10 cows, that's for sure. Ability, follow. Okay, didn't destroy, but okay. Let's, get this over. Let's do another one. Okay, that was good. Yeah, we already got the score, so that's perfect. Hmm, I wonder what the maximum score is. How much I have to do this? Ah, that we got plus 10, okay. These boxes exist too, plus 10, that's good. And throw them all, good. I got more than I expected. And I can't get through here, it looks like. Yeah, I'm not gonna get that plus the time box, but that's okay. Okay, you completed and what was the high score? Wow, Cloud! I've never seen anyone do that before! See? Pretty fun, right? Play with us again, okay? Okay. Yeah, I will in the future, but now let's do the next quest. And we have to go back out here. And it doesn't look like these quests will be very long, which I hope. That means we can continue on with the next chapter, I hope. Next chapter should be chapter 10, I mean 9 then. And let's see, back here somewhere, okay. At the community center, if I'm not mistaken, there is one. Back here, nope. Went the wrong way, I think. 
I think it can get to the community center here too. Yep, you can. And there he is. Uh, you wouldn't happen to be a certain merc that's become the talk of the town? Yep. I'm Damon. Little more than a humble reporter with the daily buzz. Ah, uh, that rag? The one that's always printing awful rumors about the slums? On the contrary, my dear. We strive to raise awareness of the plight of our undercity brethren. We seek a better future for everyone, rich and poor. Now then, my friends, I find myself in need of your exceptional services for a trifling matter. Are you familiar with the mysterious and notorious bandit known as the Angel of the Slums? She delivers written declarations to her victims, usually Shinra associates, before divesting them of their valuables. Everyone knows her. Everything she steals, she gives to the poor and needy. Yes, she's got a knack for public relations. Very popular down here as a result. Nevertheless, she is a criminal and a threat to the public order. I've made it my mission to unmask the villain, but the locals have been uncooperative and uncommunicative, to put it mildly. And now that my identity as a reporter has been exposed, my sources have all deserted me. Which brings me to you, the work of the hour, and the man who will serve up my scoop. Okay, if I have to. In here, what? I thought we put those days of war and death behind us. Okay, who should I talk to now? I won't let us move on. Just gonna look around. What about you? You have your. What's that? The guardian angel of the slums? Come to think of it, a reporter came sniffing around asking about her. You his man? Huh. Even if I knew something, I wouldn't tell you. To folks around here, the angel is a hero. I ain't selling her out to Shinra. Oh, can't believe you can get paid to dig up people's secrets. Even a bandit makes a more honest living than that reporter. Oh, can't believe you can get paid to dig up okay, people's secrets. Okay, he's just gonna repeat him himself. So uh, let's see if there's anyone else willing to speak. What about you? What? Do I know the guardian angel of the slums? Well, I don't know much, but I do know she doesn't steal from the poor, and she doesn't kill anyone either. Far as I'm concerned, that's all I need to know. If that's not enough for you, the one you ought to talk to is Marae. Ask anyone, and they'll tell you she knows everything about everyone around here. Okay, I will. And could that be you? Good to see you again, Marae. Good to see you too, Aerith. I'd heard you found yourself a funny new friend. Cloud, meet Mireille. She knows everything there is to know about the slums. Mireille, meet Cloud. He's a former soldier and super strong. Hmm, he looks useful enough. The kids have been talking about you. The defender of the secret hideout. And now the hero of the Leaf House is helping the Daily Buzz look for the angel of the slums. I am? <laughs> I'm a lover of the whispered word. Not that it's any real secret, considering how chatty the Shinra mutt's been. Not looking into it for the reporter. I'm doing it for myself. Call it curiosity, whatever. Or could it be you've fallen under the angel's spell like so many others? Anyway, it so happens that I have some information for you. But I'll need a moment before I can give it to you. Why don't you wait with that reporter of yours? Okay, I will. Follow her, go to the reporter, go to reporter, okay. So, any news? Have you tried talking to Marae at all? She told us that she had some information to share. Marae? As in the Marae? The town gossip? I chased her for days begging for info, but she wouldn't give up a single scrap! So how do you get the old bird to talk? This old bird had a change of heart, that's all. Then quickly, before you have another, tell us. What do you know about the notorious angel of the slums? Has she struck again? Is that it? I don't know anything about that, but I do know where her hideout is. Her base of operations? Now that's a scoop! Where is it? Tell me! Deep in the scrap, at lookout point. Hardly anyone goes out there these days. It's the perfect place for a criminal to hold up. Look out, Point. Got it! I'll check it out right now. But before you go, I should warn you about this rumor I heard. 
about a terrible fiend that's claimed the Angel's hideout as its lair. Oh, quite large. Lots of teeth. Always hungry. I don't know about you, but I'd not go anywhere near that thing. Oh, well, uh... <clears throat> well, a good reporter knows never to take foolish risks. Uh, plan first, then act. That's every respectable journalist motto. If it's a plan you're looking for, I'd say you have one right here, wouldn't you? So, my good mercenary, if I might impose upon you again, it would be lovely if you investigated Lookout Point for me. Okay, I will. The Angel of the Slum. I wonder who she is. Yeah, we'll find out eventually, once we get there. Yeah, I mean, we have to go back here again, right? Through the hideout, I would expect. Let's have a quick look. No, it doesn't look like we do. Now I'll go back. We don't have to go back there. And that's already good news. I mean, we have to go back here somewhere, huh? Guess so. We're probably through here, right? Yep, and there it is. Okay. It should be the correct way now. We were here before with other for other mission, for other quest. I, quest, I should say that because these are not missions; these are side quests. So just gotta find the angel of the slums now. Shouldn't be that that hard. I hope. Just gotta find the correct way. Door is locked. Can't go this way, okay. Let's look back here now. Maybe this is the correct way. Should I go up there? Okay, somewhere back here, okay. No problemo. Already over here. Where I go when I go up there? Okay, I see. And there's the other gate. Oh, this is where we were at the very beginning, I think. Let's look at the map. Yeah, we should probably just go this way. That way is useless. Can't go that way anyway, as long as it's closed. Now, ah, a few monsters. Oh, come on. Try to stay now, right. finally. That's true. Well, get off me, would ya? Okay, down we go. See ya. This way or the other way? Probably should go this way. Yeah, well, it's probably going, going to be the only way we can go. Or at least the correct way. Haven't been back here yet. Yep. This is the correct way, it looks like. And we got a big monster here. Okay, there he is. Target located. Angel of the slums. Come on. Oh, that does a lot of damage. A lot of damage. That means I gotta watch out. See? I'm already dying. So then, nope. Can't use other abilities. Now I can. And of course, cure myself. Yeah, perfect. Now let's attack him again. Come on, start attacking him, would ya? Gotta stay back. No, I don't wanna do that now, do I? Okay, get back, get back. Can't use any spells right now, great. Can use abilities. Don't wanna attack that, of course. Come on, get out of there, would ya? Don't attack that. That's useless. How can that actually be the angel of the slums when can't really attack anything? I mean, steal stuff from people. Get it back, get back, get back. Ooh. Uh, it's gonna take a while to take him down, it looks like. Can I get out of there? Now go in. Start attacking him a few times again. Of course, I can't attack that. That doesn't do any damage. 
get out of there before you attack. Come on, come on, come on, come on, get out of there. Okay, now let's... Oh, can't use a spell, great. Let's do that. Nope, don't want to attack that, of course. Why can't you dodge that? Nope, don't do any damage. Whoa, that almost hit us, didn't it? Really, 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 really. Stay back, I am staying back, don't worry. Just gotta wait now and attack a few times. And I'll get back. And now I can use it again, cure myself. Let's try that again. Okay, now let's try it again. Okay, nope. That was weird. That big was. Um, that's it. Okay, that's it, good. This one's for you. This one's for you, yes it is. I gotta get back, gotta get back before he starts attacking me again. And now I got him. I dodged that, I dodged that. But okay, whatever. Feeling good. Okay, spell. Let's see if this does more damage. Or if it does anything. Shatter. Okay. Let's get out of there before it starts attacking again. Okay, spells. Fire. Need a light. That's it. That's it, huh? Get out of there. Okay, once I can, I will kill you, don't worry. Oop, but before that... Spells, can I still use it? Yep, I can, good. You need the health, so... Perfect. And if I were you, I would dodge, but I guess you can't. Okay, now it's another... Okay, you can use this one. Burn! Back it back, why not? Let's do this. I'm uh, about halfway through, well, well, halfway through, that's good. Okay, just gotta get through here now. And boom. Of course, I don't wanna attack that. Okay, abilities and. Perfect. Okay, more than half of his health is gone. So that's good. No holding back, that's true. Get back, get back. Looks like he's only gonna attack her for now. It's strange, but so what? Good for me, right? Yeah, I hope you won't. Okay, once... I have my limit too, then. We can both attack her. No, not good, not good, not good. Okay, now both of us are going to attack him. First me. And then her. Be close, just in case. And what will this be? Oh, I'm just going to replant party members here. You do any damage? You've I don't know. How did that? Really? 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 Okay. Yeah, it should be enough. 
Go on. Yep, about three quarters of the way. That wasn't no, it was not. Oh, almost had me, didn't you, bro? Stop attacking that. Just attack him, would you? Okay, abilities now attack. Oh, really? Item, five potion, that's for you. Once I can, of course. Get out of there, get out of there. Whoa. And start attacking him again. And this is not gonna be... This is gonna be easy, but it's gonna take a while. Yeah, but it's not a hard boss fight, but a pretty easy one. And she's... I fell unconscious, okay. Come on, not now, not again, not again, not again, not again. Ooh, that was a close one. Phoenix down. Where are you? There you are. You'll feel better in a second. You'll feel better in a second. Mega potion. Just okay. taking a little break. Who are you? What the hell? Now she's unconscious or so what? Brace yourself. Brace yourself. Okay, now I gotta wait, I gotta wait. I'm not gonna risk it. I am definitely not gonna risk anything. Okay, Phoenix down and there we have it. Still up for it. Still up for it. Don't overdo it. Yeah, don't overdo it. Stay strong and carry on. I'm coming. Okay, what kind of bullshit was that just now? Yeah. Oh, don't attack me, don't attack me. <laughs> oh, that was a close call. Okay, can't use anything right now, but okay. Okay, now items. Another Phoenix down, of course. And... Be careful. Revive. Let's Good. pretend that didn't happen. Yeah, let's pretend that didn't happen. Because I don't want to attack that. Get out of here, get out of here, would you? Like I said, we're almost done for. Almost. Okay, she's unconscious again, huh? Okay, this isn't good. Come on, get it back, get back, get back, get back, get back, get back. Get back. Do we really want to waste another Phoenix down? Yep, we do. Still up for it. Still up okay, for it. High potion. So you don't die immediately again. Oh no, let's attack him again. Really? He's almost done again? Okay, abilities. Finally! Around. Yeah, I guess we should. The guardian angel of the slums will collect your offering on behalf of the poor. This must be one of her calling cards. I don't see anything else interesting. Let's head back and tell him what we found. You found one of her calling cards! This is the genuine article, I'm sure of it! Penned by the angel herself! Hmm. So this is one of her famous warnings. It's an incredible find! Oh, was that all? Hold on. Looks like there's something else. A message. To the nosy Shinra reporter sniffing around, I was planning to teach you a lesson you would never forget. However, by the grace of your mercenary friend, you were spared that lesson. But next time he might not be around to save you. You would be wise to watch your step. Not just a message from the angel. A warning. <sighs> if the merc here hadn't bailed you out, that fiend in the scrap would have ripped you to shreds. 
Sorry about that, friend. Here I was, just trying to help you out. But instead, my kindness almost got you violently killed. Now, now. <laughs> no harm, no foul, right? In any case, I hope this narrowly averted tragedy won't discourage you from sharing information with me in the future. Hey, everybody! The angel left another calling card! She's gonna rip up Don Corneo! It's about damn time! Don Corneo's no easy mark! I can't wait to see how this goes down! Excuse me, I'm a reporter for the Daily Buzz and... So much for my reward. Here, why don't you take this? Oh, and no need to thank me. Let's just say it slipped out of that reporter's bucket. <laughs> Can't call it theft if you're just claiming what you're owed. Am I right? Well done, Mr. Merck. You certainly lived up to your reputation. Oh, yes, I do. You know, there's a rumor that the Angel of the Slums is as radiant and beautiful as she is daring. Personally, I think that one's true. Oh, is it? Okay, just one more quest left. Paying respects. Okay. Years ago when I, came to I was actually planning on doing another story quest, but guess I'm gonna do that in the next video. Now we just have to go pay them respects. Up here, I guess? Yep. And what about you? I know you. You must be that mercenary. I have a problem. It's the anniversary of my wife's death and I wanted to visit her grave. But I can't because some creatures have turned the graveyard into their nest. Could you do me a favor and go there in my stead? She shouldn't be alone today. It'll cost you. That's fine, that's fine. The graveyard's right by the head of the river. But I heard they put a new gate in recently to replace the old broken one. Now that those creatures have moved in, I'm sure it's locked up tight. A key to the graveyard, huh? I know. Why don't we ask Oats about it? Okay, we will. Yeah. That was the little boy, right? Yep, I think it was. So we have to go back here again. And see if we can find a key to the graveyard. Anyway guys, I hope you've been enjoying my walkthrough so far. If you have, don't forget to smack that like button. Of course, subscribe for all my future videos, including the rest of my Final Fantasy VII walkthrough. Wait, you're not looking for the key to the graveyard gate, are you? Well, it's your lucky day. The angel took it. Stole from some public security jerks. She gave it to Marty, so I'm guessing he's selling it for medals now. I bet he is, okay. You don't happen to have a key to a graveyard, do you? Of course! The Emporium has everything, Kubo. That means I have to buy it, huh? Where is that graveyard key? Okay, just one medal, that's good. Thanks, you guys! I've got a whole mountain of Moogle medals now. Soon I'll be able to make everyone here super happy. That's wonderful. So, like Mog the Moogle, you'll be able to make all our hopes and dreams come true? Not just yours, Koopa. The wishes of every single person in the swamps. It's a lot of wishes. Lots of people in Midgar love to collect Moogle medals, you know. They'll pay anything to get their hands on more. I'm using the money to set up more shops all throughout the swamps, Koopa. I'm giving jobs to the other kids and making life better for everyone here. And that's how I'll make everyone happy. That's one way of doing it, Koopo. And I've got extra happiness for you two. So what's to stop us from selling directly to these collectors? Uh, Moogle Magic, Koopo? Next time, keep your plans to yourself. Thanks, you guys. By working together, I know we can make the world a happier place. Oh, really? Okay. I just have to go this way, huh? And get to the graveyard. Okay, I'm going the correct way. Let's look. Uh, let's have a look. Somewhere up here. 
Definitely looks like I took the correct way. Hmm. Okay, I can't zoom out, that's good. And nope, not did not take the correct way. Gotta go back out. Well, what do you yeah, think? keep it up. Would it take? Yeah, did not take the correct way. Now let's get out of here once again. Anyway, I hope you've been enjoying this walkthrough so far. If you have, don't forget to smack that like button. Of course, subscribe for all my future videos, including the rest of my Final Fantasy VII Remake walkthrough. And of course, for all my future walkthroughs, don't forget to smack that notifications button so you'll be notified when I upload in the future. As always, guys, thank you for supporting my channel. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And let's continue on with Chapter 8 of the side missions. Side quests, I mean, of course. And this is one where we go to a graveyard now. And I was actually planning on continuing on with the main story, but with these quests, with these quests being so long, I guess I'm gonna. No turning back. No turning back. Target found. Just go away, would you? Yeah, I'm definitely not like that. Come on. Let's take him down now. Nope. Got that attack, that's good. Get away from me. I can't even dodge attack, that is very strange. See? Dodging attacks and still he still hits me. Back. Now let's use this. You see one? Or oh, maybe not. Yeah, oh, get out of there. I wish he would just stay away from me. Staggered. Going in. Now ability and let's use this and really? Not looking good. That's right. What the hell? Wait, seriously? That was strange. Cloud, okay. You okay? Up and, at him. and here I have another one. Let's use a mega potion on him. I'll take care. He's doing good. Just taking a My little turn. break. Just taking a little break. <laughs> ah, get out of here, would ya? Okay. Almost have one down. One is almost done for. No, come on. Get out of here, would ya? Get away from me. Little fast spell and cure. Ain't dead yet. Almost done for good. Oh, come on! See? And they still hit me. This is pure bullshit. Staggered, now it's done for. Let's hope he's all done for. Okay, the first one is done for good. And the second one. The next one shouldn't be that hard to take down, I hope. Come on, recover, would ya? If he's okay now, and spell. Cure myself first. Come on. And then we'll cure her too. It's a high potion. Go on. Okay, which one has least health? Okay, now let's take him out. Limit. Yeah, number A. Yeah, that's good. That's how you do it. Yeah. I almost got the next one. What? What just happened? And now I'm losing a lot of health again. Yeah, 
No, it's got the second one done for done for two. Okay, now this should take him out. I hope. Well, almost. Now it's done for good. Just one more left. It shouldn't be hard to take down. I hope. Come on, get over here and. Okay, and abilities and another attack. Okay, almost done for. Get over here, would ya? Nope. Ah, she's unconscious. Shit. Okay, at least I'm gonna take him down now. This must be it. Looks like it is. Hey, you wanna say a prayer too? No thanks. I think you've got it covered. I'm really grateful for what you did. Here's your reward. I owe him a lot. Maybe more than I can ever repay. And now, I owe you a lot, too. I know it's not much, but I hope it makes up for it a little bit. We paid our respects to your wife. And we took care of those creatures. Oh, that's such a relief to hear. I can't tell you how much it was weighing on my mind. I was beginning to think I might never be able to visit her grave again. With my bad back and my legs, my whole body's a mess, frankly. I... I didn't think I could make it past the creatures. But I was prepared to die trying, and then you two came along. Still, I've got to face facts. Creatures or no, I can't keep making these trips. Don't say that. This is the graveyard key. Run it back to Moggy. But I just told you about my legs. Why don't you just give it back? Okay. It'll cost you 5,000 gil, though. 5,000? It's always money with you people. <laughs> Fine. I won't ask you for anything else. I'll take your damned key and give it to the boy. <sighs> it's downright depressing. What is the world coming to these days? Okay then guys, that was the last one. We probably ought to call it a day. Getting late, huh? You've been working so hard you lost track of time. You had to. The pace sucked. Cause they didn't know if you were worth it yet. But now they do. Come on, let's go home. Okay, we will. Well then guys, this will be the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to smack that like button. Of course, subscribe for all my future videos, including the rest of my Final Fantasy VII Remake walks. And of course, for all my future walkthroughs, don't forget to smack that notifications button. So be notified when I upload in the future. As always, guys, thank you for supporting my channel. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys all in my next video. Peace.